hello guys welcome to today's episode in this video we are going to be talking about the difference between dot com and dot net so guys have you ever been wondering what the difference between these two these two domains so in this video i'm going to be explaining the difference and the purpose of each of the domains guys always know bear in mind that choosing the right domain is a is a very important aspect of your business or your website so always make sure you go for a domain that is suitable for your business or that is suitable for your website so in this tutorial we will explain the major difference between these two domains and of course which one is good or better for your website so guys before we get started let's talk about what a domain is a domain is literally your website's address on the internet. I mean, it's the name of your website on the internet. So, domain names always come with different extensions like .com, .net, .org, .com, .ng, and so on. So, there are numerous domain extensions that you can choose from, but we are concentrating on .com and .net in this video. So guys, this is GoDaddy and we'll be checking the price of each of these domain tools on these two platforms, GoDaddy and Namecheap. So this is Namecheap website and this is GoDaddy's website. So as for .com, .com is basically for commercial sites, personal blog and portfolios and more. But in terms of .NET, it, it was originally built for networking businesses like that is a email service providers, internet service providers, and so on. But this doesn't stop you from using it on, on your website if you are running a personal blog or other. But the one that is suitable for personal blog, commercial site, site you intend to make profit from or make money from is um dot com and also it is very easy for people to remember dot com than any other domain which means dot com is much popular than every other domain and dot com is what i recommend you should use if you intend to get a domain for your website or for your business i think or I recommend that you should go for .com so to get a domain name you can get a domain name from either Namecheap or from GoDaddy and in this video we'll be checking the price for each registrar and to know which one is more, more expensive and this one, which one is cheaper and when choosing in a domain name always make sure you choose something that your users can easily type into their web browser something they can easily remember so don't go and start using a domain name that is very long that will take your users time to even remember or cannot even remember at all So, if you want to buy a .NET domain, I suggest you buy it if you want to run a networking business or you want to run a database hosting, email hosting and other services that are related to networking. So guys, let's check out the price now. For Namecheap, let's see how much it costs to get a domain on Namecheap. To do that, just go to the domain area and click on the domain name search.
type in the domain name that you want to buy for example let's type in let's check if this domain is available and let's check out the price for it Okay guys, this domain is very very available and the price for the domain is $9 per year. So this is the first uh, search for .com and we're going to be searching for .net to, to see, compare both price and see which one is more expensive. So let's search for another domain to confirm the price if the price is going to be the same. So you can see guys the price are the, the prices are the same the price for the first one and this one they are same 9.48 dollar per year so guys this is the price of dot com if you want to make use of name cheap so now the next thing we're going to be searching for is dot net So guys you can see the price the price of .NET here on NCHIP is ten point ninety eight dollar per year. So which means the .NET on NCHIP is more expensive than .com. So let's do a second search and see if the price will match. So guys, as you can see here, the price, the price is the same, ten point ninety eight dollar per year. So it means that if you are getting a dot com to me here on Namecheap, you will get it for nine point forty eight cent. But as for dot net, you will get it for ten point ninety eight dollar. Sorry, if you are getting a dot com to me on Namecheap, is nine. Point forty eight dollar, but for dot net you're gonna get it for ten point ninety eight dollar per year. So now let's go to GoDaddy and compare the price, and let's see which of the two registrar is is cheaper. So now let's find our first domain. Let's find dot com. So guys you can see here yeah, the domains are available and the price is <laughs> 0 0.99 0 0.99 euros this is not pounds this is pounds guys so 0 0.99 pounds and for the first year with a two year registration so if if you want to register this domain for two years you will get it for this amount here as you can see which means it's very cheap but it comes with a condition if you are going to register it for two years but if you want to buy it for just one year i guess this is the price here wow <laughs> this one has conditions so let's search for .net and see So guys, for .NET, the price here is 11.99 pounds per year. So guys, you can see very well that both on Namecheap and on GoDaddy, .NET domain is more expensive than .com domain. 
and if i if i'm to recommend for you i suggest you go for dot com which is more popular and it's going to be suitable if you are running a personal blog a commercial site and, and so on but if you want to go into networking and email email reselling email services and so on then you can go for dot net domain extensions so, all right guys that is all for this video if you find this video helpful please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the like button and of course click on the bell notification all right guys so this is basically the difference between the com domain and dot net domain bye